Chapter 10, The Secret Powers of My Batman Ring. This is what happens when you wear a Batman ring. You can fly like a bat, turning left out of the bat school, and be the first on the playground for recess. You can hang upside down on the monkey bars forever. You can see in the dark, you can emit sonar waves, but you still can't pay attention in class. In fact, it's even harder than ever to concentrate. You just keep thinking about all the fantastic things you can do now that you're wearing a Batman ring. It was reading class. Reading class is better than writing class, but it still takes a lot of concentration. Everyone takes turns reading, which means you have to move your finger right along the words and not lose your place. This is hard to do. It is even harder to do when you're a bat and your fingers are all webbed together. The other problem with reading when you're a bat is your eyes. Bat eyes are very good for reading in the dark, but they are horrible at reading in the light. No matter how hard you squint, your beady eyes might as well be a couple of useless marbles in your head. The only thing that still works for a bat in reading class is his ears. Alvin? I twisted my Batman ring. It was Miss P. She is very nice, but she has a habit of calling on you when you least expect it. It's your turn, honey. Honey? My bat fur melted a little. My toes loosened from the bar under my chair. I swung in the breeze. I can't read out loud in class. My voice doesn't work. But Miss P calls on me anyway, just to be fair. She's very nice, especially when she calls me honey. The hand on the clock clicked. Tick, tick, tick. Somewhere a bat wing went tap, tap, tap. Miss P waited patiently, then she moved on. Fauntleroy, Miss, po Miss P called on Pinky. That is his real name. It's not the best name in the world, but it's all he's got besides Pinky. Pinky is not a great reader, but normally he reads okay. But today, Pinky was not normal. He shifted his beady eyes. He showed his vampire teeth. Silence. Sam? called Miss P. Silence. Eli? What's going on with the boys today? asked Miss P. All the girls have read wonderfully, but you boys are acting very strange. They're bats, said Flea, who was sitting next to me. She sees more things out of her one good eye than most people see out of two. Bats, said Miss Flea. You mean they're pretending to be bats? No, Miss P, said Flea. I mean they're real bats. Oh, and bats can't read in the light, Flea added matter-of-factly. Their eyes don't work that way. They can only read in the dark. It all started with Alvin's ring, said Sarah Jane. Then all the boys made rings like it in art class. Oh, Miss P looked over at the clay rings pinched on the boys' fingers. Then she strolled over to my desk. I kept my eyes low. I kept my hands in plain sight. When you are wearing bling, it is important to act as normal as possible. Miss P's eyes fell on my hand. She gasped. A Batman ring? I haven't seen one since I was about your age. Mine had a special secret power that melted evil villains on the spot, she added. My ring can melt UFOs, said Scooter. And my ring can melt monsters, said Naya. My ring can melt the principal, blurted Hobson. Oops. Why don't we put the rings away for safekeeping, said Miss P. You can have them back at the end of the day. Before we knew it, all our bat rings were in her desk, including my one and only true, genuine, authentic, real Batman ring that started it all. I twisted a phantom ring on my finger. It felt terrible. My mom says that it is Miss P's first year of teaching and that I should always be on my best behavior on account of Miss P might not know what to do if I am not. But she knew what to do with my bat ran, Batman ring, that's for sure. School was no fun after that. It's a good idea to keep our valuables at home, said Miss P when I finally went to her desk to pick up my Batman ring at the end of the day. You wouldn't want to lose something like that. You'll need it to protect yourself from much scarier things than school. Much scarier things than school? What could be much scarier than school? I scratched my side. Then I scratched the back of my neck. Then I remembered.